friends let's solve one of the exercise problem if a line intersects two concentric circles concentric circle means both the circles are having the same center at o and let the line in, is intersecting at point a b c and d and we have to prove a b is equal to c d now see here the properties which i have discussed in the previous videos will be used here so if you remember there is a property which says that if a perpendicular line falls from the center of the circle then it will bisect the chord bc is a chord for the inner circle so if this uh, om is a perpendicular line drawn by construction let us say om is perpendicular to bc then bm will be equal to mc by the theorem it will bisect the chord similarly om is also a perpendicular line for the outer circle chord ad that means again this complete am will be equal to md isn't it so we can write also om is perpendicular to the uh, outer circle chord ad <coughs> isn't it so we can also say am is equal to md because the line perpendicular from the center to the chord bisects the chord so am is equal to md now uh, let's prove it and in given whatever is there in the question is to be written that uh, it is the concentric circle so same line line intersects uh, two intersect uh, concentric circle with center a and a B, at point a b c and d same thing you have to, a line intersects the circle at from here to here a line intersects two concentric circles with center o at a b c and d now let's prove it and uh, what is to be proved this is to be proved after construction uh, after given uh, it uh, to prove is to be written so what is to be proved we have to prove that a b is equal to c d and after to prove write construction given to prove then construction and then proof so in proof uh, we can write bm is equal to mc by construction isn't it by construction then uh, also we know am is equal to md again by construction now what can be done let's say this is equation 1 this is equation 2 my equation 2 minus equation 1 so what we are doing actually is am minus bm is equal to md minus mc now look at the figure carefully if what will happen if we subtract bm from am am is this complete if we subtract this bm portion we will be left with ab from this am if bm is subtract subtracted then only ab is left so we will write ab here is equal to similarly from md if mc is subtracted we are left with cd and so is the result this is what we had to prove ab is equal to cd and we got the result hence proved only the construction part was the crux of the problem with the help of which we have proved the question thank you